What's up? This is Tom with Elevating WordPress, and in this video I'm going to be reviewing SiteGround's Grow Big plan and show you the difference between that and their Startup and Go Geek plan. Obviously, besides the price, which is um, $14.95 a month, I would wait until it's discounted, like right now, to $7.95 a month. But with Grow Big, the main differences are you can host unlimited websites. It's faster than startup, and you get priority support. So you can see a side-by-side -side comparison by clicking the C plan details. And I know saying, you know, it's faster is general, but if you scroll all the way down into we allocate the resources you need and hover over these server tabs, you can see it gets faster as you upgrade plans. So for only $4 a month more than startup, you get basically double the amount of server resources, you can host unlimited websites, and you get priority support, which is the main difference, like I said. I think it's the best value in my opinion, but you also get a few additional features. So you get more web storage, more email storage, obviously free domain name like it says, uh, free migration if you're migrating from another hosting company Sci SiteGround will actually migrate you for free The WordPress special cache you can't ignore um, I would recommend using a different cache plugin than SiteGrounds like W3 Total Cache, WP, WP Fastest Cache, or WP Super Cache Check the comments for tutorials that I wrote. It helped people get like 98% page speed load times and GT metrics and I'm hosted with SiteGround by the way this basically outlines everything with Grow Big um, I'm kinda going over this already but you know all three levels of super cache a backup and re restoration service so uh, that's basically like a tool that makes it easier to restore your website if you need Premium wildcard SSL is optional, but it allows you to put an SSL on subdomains, more storage, more email storage, and more server resources, which is the speed thing that I talked about. So this is my website, and if you click through all the different pages, it loads pretty instantly. And I'm hosted with SiteGround. Um, in GT metrics, I think I have about a 0.5 second load time. On a good day, you know, GT metrics fluctuates, but I have gotten 0.5 seconds. And, uh, you know, other, <clears throat> other than that, you can uh, hover over each tab to see which each one is. But, like I said, I would ignore the, w, the WordPress special cache and the super cacher. You know, it doesn't matter because I would not recommend using their plugin. So with Grow Big, you also get 30 daily backups as opposed to just one. You get that, that backup and restore tool like I mentioned. You get priority support. SiteGround support is amazing regardless, but it'll just be a little faster. And the premium wildcard SSL allows you to host um, the SSL on unlimited, sub, on unlimited subdomains. But yeah, I would say the only reason to upgrade to Geeky is if you want an even faster website, so if your site's super slow, you may consider that. But I did write a really good WordPress speed optimization guide that I'll link to in the comments. Um, I would suggest doing all the free stuff first, like optimizing your images, using a lightweight theme, install, configuring a cache plugin with Cloudflare, then consider the paid stuff like upgrading your host, configuring Mac CDN's content delivery network. But those things are definitely going to make your site faster. And I would also check out, you know, if you want to learn about their data centers and speed technology and uptime technology, you can do so here. Uh, but I do think Grow Big is definitely the best value, considering it's only $4 more a month than startup, and you can host unlimited websites, which is awesome. So if you enjoy this tutorial, I did include an affiliate link in the comments section. Um, it basically earns me a commission off the sale at no expense to you, and I would just really appreciate it if you did that. If you are signing up for SiteGround, I have bills to pay, $10,000 in student loans.
but uh, if you don't want to, that's fine too. But yeah, that's uh, that's Grow Big. Definitely would recommend it, and I hope you enjoyed this video.